Residents in northern New Mexico are fed up with seemingly constant burglaries in their community. Now they're using social media to fight back. News 13's Candace Hopkins is live in Española with more. Kim, the page is called Stopping Residential Burglaries, and neighbors say that it's helping them take back the fight against criminals in their own backyards. They had taken all my TVs, my laptop, anything. They took three jewelry boxes. Sarah Rivas is a single mother of three young girls, a college student working hard to provide for her family. But back in March, she arrived home to find it ransacked, the thieves stealing much more than just the family's belongings. My biggest fear was, Will they come back and are me and my kids going to be safe? I don't have a window. I don't have any protection. Sarah says she knows the police can only do so much to help, so she turned to this Facebook page. She, like other residents, can post tips about crime in the area, a type of virtual neighborhood watch. Everything from warning others about break-ins to stolen pets. There's even a post about someone stealing a deck right from their home. The Rio Arriba County Sheriff's Department says there is something on this page that is alarming to them. Residents are posting warnings about specific individuals and linking them to those crimes, something they caution users against doing. Give us the information. Let us gather everything that we need to do so that we can affect warrants and make arrests and solve these crimes. A process these residents vow to continue to play an important role in. We're going to take our community back. There's no, we're not going to sit there and let this happen. More than 500 people are currently members of this group, but sheriff's deputies say they hope more people continue to join because the leads and information have been very valuable. Back to you, Kim. Okay, thanks, Candace. Now, deputies say it was a community tip that all, all actually led to the recovery of loads of stolen goods just about a month ago. Now, they say what's interesting about this is that this Facebook page was started about a year ago by a Rio Reba County sheriff's deputy.